Hey guys, I'm Kyle. I'm Willie. I'm Mike. And I'm Tyler. And we're Kyle Bryant and the New Day Drivers. And uh, like you saw at the beginning of the video, we're actually going to be releasing a new EP, uh, what, next week? Right? Yes. Yeah. Next week. Yeah. And so um, we had a cool idea to make a video kind of talking about each song from the EP and to release that each day. And just kind of talk about you and the song and stuff. And uh, each day we'll also post the song on our website, which you saw. And uh, you'll be able to listen to it there and everything. And then on Tuesday the 12th, which is release day, uh, you'll be able to have all the songs to listen to and you'll be able to buy it as well. And so it's kind of a way to, you know, play it up and stuff. But we thought it'd be fun, you know, kind of get a behind the scenes on uh, what we did. So it's day... Who know? Day one, yeah. And so that means the first track on the CD is Dying to Live. And so... Um, <laughs> We're going to talk about Dying to Live uh, for a minute. So basically, Dying to Live is kind of a, a rock, rocking song, right? We were feeling uh, Foo Fighters, kind of. We weren't ripping them off, but we were feeling some Foo Fighters in this. And so, um, actually, when we were like, usually when we write, a lot of times we write as a band, and musically, we'll come up with stuff and like bounce ideas off each other, and then we'll kind of piece it together, and then I'll write lyrics and stuff on top of it. And, uh, but with this one, I think, Tyler, didn't you come yeah. up with it? Dog, I'm not sure if you look at you, I don't remember. Look at you. Yeah. It, was, uh, it was kind of a little jam that we had going on uh, for uh, at our rehearsal or practice. And, and so it just kind of turned into this rock song that we just turned into Dying to Live. It's pretty cool how the song progressed um, into what, it, what it's become. So, um, I just had this little lead lick at the beginning, and so it kind of came from that, and just went from, from that to the whole song. So it's really a pretty relatively easy song to, to write because it came so fast. It was fun. And uh, it's kind of cool because we had it kind of figured out. And actually, this is probably the, the oldest song on this record. Because I think actually with our, our last EP, we wrote this song not long after we finished um, the one bef before it. It was like maybe a month after we were done. But uh, we went to record it and our producer, Matt, kind of uh, had a few ideas to bounce off of to, to bring it a little more to the rock level, <laughs> I guess. And uh, But it was fun like with the bridge, the way it is, the different stuff. But you'll get to hear it and enjoy it that way. But also just as far as lyrically with this song, because I know a lot of times people hear lyrics and like what does that mean? Uh, but with this one, kind of the basic idea was a lot of times when I write songs, um, it'll start out uh, with like a hook line or like a, a very specific sentence or phrase or something, and then I'll kind of flesh out the song off that. And uh, that's pretty common for me with my writing. And basically, one day I just had, kind of had that line, you know, uh, to be living, to be dying to live and not living just to die, kind of come to mind. And uh, I kind of started to kind of think on that. And basically I was reflecting on my, on my own life with the fact that so many times I might go through my day and um, I'm almost just kind of going through the motions of the day. And I'm not really um, living life on purpose, being intentional with what I do. And um, in, in the Bible, which we all as men believe in the Bible, we like the Bible, um, and Jesus. And, but but uh, with that, uh, in Scripture, Christ commands us to, to die to ourselves each day and to take up our cross. And uh, the opposite of that is instead of dying to live, you're literally just, just living just, just to die. As morbid as that is and as peppy as this song is, it's kind of a, a hard truth. And so um, I wrote the song kind of just based on that, just the idea. You know, I, I see people and I see myself so many times just going through the motions. And I wanted to kind of challenge myself. To, um, to really take hold of the day and really to, to die to myself each day and to live for the kingdom of God and to, to live for Jesus Christ and uh, to make a difference. And even in the bridge where it says, um, in the setting sun you feel the weight of all the things you said and done. Just to, the idea that um, even if, um, or if you don't die to live or vice versa, at the end of your life you're going to feel the weight of what you've done or what you haven't done at the end, because as your life ends, you'll look back and think, you know, well, what did I do or what did I not do with my time and with my life? Did I live for something that mattered or not? And um, that's a that's a big weight to, to feel. And 
So I kind of just wanted to write a song to remind myself of that. Anyway, we hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, if you uh, really like it or if you really hate it, if it's like the worst song you ever heard or not, uh, feel free to leave uh, like a comment here. Um, I think we're going to post this on Facebook with some other places too. But like on Facebook, just comment like below the video because we're going to upload it there. I can't really show that. It's somewhere down here. Comment and tell us if you like the song, if you hate the song, uh, you know, if you are really indifferent to the song. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, uh, but yeah. And so uh, we'll be doing this again tomorrow and the next day all the way till Tuesday the 12th, which is release day. We're really excited. And you'll be able to buy the CD from various places, but we'll talk about that more as we get there. Anyway, we hope you guys have a great Friday. And uh, yeah, we'll be seeing you soon. All right? Deuces. Peace out. Deuces.